550 officers in Toledo and dropping. We don't know what's going to happen with Senate Bill 5. That's going to drive the retirement number up in the month of December. Police Chief Mike Navarre says if issue two passes on the November ballot, he's expecting to see up to 50 retirements by January. He says that will be costly for the city since he can barely meet minimum shift requirements now. Just this week, three officers were put on overtime Thursday, costing $1,500. Another three Wednesday, one Tuesday, and two on Monday. And on September 1st, he recalled seven officers, costing taxpayers more than three grand. If it got into a situation where we had to force people to work overtime, then you have burnout problems. You have morale problems. You force someone to come into work. I mean, how valuable are they going to be? Due to the burnout, the Toledo Police Patrolmen's Association urged a change for the upcoming police class. While 50 cadets are scheduled to start the academy in November, seven have already been certified by the state. They are all working either as full-time or part-time officers. They've agreed to an accelerated class to start October 3rd and hit the street November 4th. So it was something that I never did. Never really had to do that. Times are different. Our numbers are so low. Extraordinary times call for extraordinary action. While it takes away five months of training for each of these seven new officers, it's also expecting to save more than $350,000 for the city.